Hello everybody! So today I'm joining you to do a makeup tutorial which is, as you can see, a bit colourful. Um, I actually um, did it with this palette that I showed you not a long time ago. That's the Sleek Eye Divine Ultra Matte Volume 1. Um, so yeah, it's actually an uh, eye makeup palette that have a lot of really, really, really bright colour in it. And I just told you in the old video that I really wanted to try some new stuff and I don't know, have fun with colour and it's what I did this week so I decided I'm gonna, I don't know, just make this video so in this I'm gonna show you two look you can have so this one is the more smoky of both and yeah, the other one is just a colourful liner I also posted you on Instagram like a double liner, so I have the black liner and the colourful liner. So as you can see there is many possibilities with this kind of look and I don't know, I just hope you're going to like it. And I'm going to let you with it with the tutorial and yeah! So the first look is more like an ombre liner but a sunset version. To begin with this look I'm obviously going to apply an eye base and this one is from Kiko. And I'm going to make my eyeliner base with a white eyeliner so the colour can pop a bit more and fix on the colour. It's not a perfect one but it's fine because we're going to blend it with a little brush after this. I should normally do it first but I totally forget it so I'm going to apply like a normal beige colour all over the lid. So just the yeah, eyeliner don't transfer on the lid. And then I'm going to use my amazing colored palette to make the ombre liner. So first I'm going to apply the yellow in the inner part, then the orange color on the middle of the lid, the pink on the outer corner and the violet just on the end of the wing. Then I'm going to curl my lashes and apply a big coat of mascara. the lips I put like a small, I'm not gonna say a really raspberry color, actually it was but um, it just goes out like kind of peachy on the camera. But yeah this is a great look, uh, you can also change it a bit by putting a bit of black eyeliner on the roots of the lashes so it just pop up a bit more. Um, I just wanted to show you the simple version and I think it looks amazing. I had a lot of compliment on this look and I'm really happy with it. And the second look is a bit more, I don't know, you have to work a bit more on it. It's more like a smoky. So again, I'm going to apply an eye base and this is still the Kiko one. And after that, I'm going to use my white pencil all over the lid and I'm going to blend it with my finger. Again, it's just to make the color pop a bit more. I'm also going to apply that white pencil under my lash line and I'm going to blend it with the little brush. Then I'm going to use the exact same color but instead of using it just on the lash line I'm going to use it all over the lid so the yellow in the first part so in the in the corner then the orange part and I'm going to blend in between every step because as I said it's kind of a smoky look and when you do a smoky you have to blend a lot. I'm going to put the pink on the inner corner and just blend and just make the kind of, I don't know, the kind of look that I want, so the shape of it, the shape of the makeup. After that I just decided I'm just going to put the violet on the inner corner and the pink on the crease because I think that it looks a bit better. So I'm going to do it as much as I want to have the color and the intensity that I want. I'm going to do the same thing to my underlash line, so the yellow, the orange and the pink. I'm going to do a cat eye eyeliner because I just think it puts everything in the right place when you're doing a really colorful makeup. apply a big coat of mascara again and I'm gonna put a more nudish color on my lips. 
Here is the final look. I hope that you guys liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I would see you guys very, very soon.